So this question starts off by telling us that V equals 1,000 times 1 1.05 to the T power. It goes on to say the given equation models the value of an antique dresser T years after its restoration, where T is between 0 at the low end and 5 on the high end. Which of the following equations best models the value of the dresser M months after its restoration, where M is between zero on the low end and 60 on the high end. So looking at my answer choices, I see that all of my answer choices contain an M value. So I'm gonna use a strategy called plug in your own number. Okay, now I know that M represents months. So I'm gonna say, well, I'm gonna say, let's use an easy number. I love, I, I love the number two. So I'm gonna say M equals 24. And I use 24 because that would mean that T equals two, right? Two years. Two years is equivalent to 24 months. So I want an equation that if I were to write it in the original form, 1,000, 1 1.05, where T is equal to two, so I get second power here, I'd get the exact same equation, but in terms of months, right? I'd say V equals 1,000. 1.05 and then basically what has to go here to make sure that's also two when I'm dealing with months. So let's look at our answer choices. So answer choice A, the first thing that I notice is that M is just by itself here, which means for my example of plugging in my own number, I'd be replacing that M with a 24, which I don't want 1.05 to the 24th power. That is not equivalent to 1.05 to the second power. Also, I'm dividing 1,000 by 12, right? There's no reason why, I'm, why I need to do that. Again, we are only focused on the exponent here. We're only focused on converting the T into months, right, for M. So A is gone. The same thing is true for B. B is also gone because why, why would I divide 1.05 by 12? And again, this M, for my example at least, will still be 24, which I don't want a 24th power. For choice C, the 1,000 is there like I like it without being changed. The 1.05 is there like I like it without being changed. Let's see what happens with this exponent. So now if M is 24, I'd have M over 12, which makes this 24 divided by 12, which makes this 2, which is exactly what I want. I want a second power, right? Because again, I want this to be equivalent. Okay, so if I call this 24 over 12, now these two equations are equivalent. Right, and that's exactly what I want. So I like choice C. Choice D has 12 times M. Right, So again, if I do 12 times 24, that's going to be a much larger number than I want because I want 2, right? So that is not equal to. So for that reason, choice C is the best answer. Using this strategy of plugging your own number and understanding that the question is not asking us to change anything about this model except for the variable, the exponent here, and the unit of that exponent. We're going from year to months, but it still has to be the exact same, right? The model has to still get the value, right? So um, hopefully that makes sense. If it does not, please do leave me a comment down in the comment section.